Hi, hey, I have learned that one of the genres of YouTube videos is the unboxing video. And I have a box. It's pretty exciting stuff. This has one of the very first of the Houghton H3 mouthpieces in it. And I'm going to unbox it here for you. First off, I got my X-Acto knife. I got to cut this thing open and get this, this thing started. So, a little tape. Cut it here so I can get it open good. In the past, ah, is it gonna go? No, I failed. I can't get it out. I'll never be able to play it. Okay, no, it's, it's kind of, okay. Now we're there. Ooh, packaged expertly. Now this thing has in it not only this Hoden H3 mouthpiece, it also has two mouthpieces I had loaned them. Uh, as part of their development process, which is why I'm kind of excited and why I'm such a, like an early insider in this thing. So we have these little blue tubes with mouthpieces, and that's kind of cool. I've never even seen that done before. So this one has, so each one has a mouthpiece. This one is a mouthpiece I loaned them. It's a Farkas model block letter Shilke. This actually is the mouthpiece I won my job in Nashville playing this mouthpiece. I've got another one in here, which is a, a sort of a duplicate that I picked up. And here is the new, whoa, <laughs> look at that. It actually is very cool. Stainless steel. It's an H3 mouthpiece. It's based on the Shulky Farkas model mouthpiece, which we have here. But it's stainless steel. i got to clean this thing up and blow on it a little bit. So let's try it. Okay, I'm back again. I didn't introduce myself, by the way. I'm John Erickson, also known as Dr. Q of the University of Horn Matters. Well, anyway, I, uh, we've, I've been working on this website, Horn Matters, for a while. There's an article on there about the Farkas model mouthpiece, which you can search for, and it tells about the Farkas model mouthpiece. Now, this one, look at, at the rims over my glasses because I'm, like, blind. The rim looks great, and I am, like, super excited to try this after trying it out looks like a duplicate, like a real good duplicate of that room, which again is one I really liked, but I had quit playing on because I became allergic to playing on silver rims. This is stainless steel, so we ought to be pretty good here. The weighting is very, it's just like a little different on the shape and stuff. All right. <laughs> Feels good, I'll tell you that. I'll put it on a horn pretty soon. I'm very excited though to try this out, so that's it. The new mouthpiece, I got like one of the first ones sold, which is pretty fun. So here we are. Thanks for watching. That's Unpacking the Houghton H3.